Hello friends, welcome back to Slide Hunt. Today in this tutorial we learn how to insert an element to a linear array. Insertion means adding an element to the array. Suppose this is a linear array A. Here we insert an element. If we want to insert an element to the last position then it's very simple. Just put the element to this position. But if we want to insert an element to the kth position of the array where k is less than upper bound, then what happen? Suppose this is a linear array A, this is the kth position and here we want to insert the element 7. But this position is already occupied by another element. So how we can insert the new element to this position? To insert the new element, first we have to create an empty face here. For that we need to shift all the elements from k to upper bound one position right means shift 9 here then 8 here now kth position is empty and we can put here 7 ok next we see the algorithm suppose a is a linear array that has n elements and we insert the element x at kth position so the first thing that we need to do in a slice a counter to upper bound. Since here we consider first element is 0th position, so the upper bound will be number of element minus 1. Here number of element is n, that's why we write here i equal to n minus 1. For this example, here we consider n equal to 5, x equal to 7, k equal to 3 and i equal to 4. Next we check the condition while k less equal to i. If this condition is true, then we shift ith element to i plus 1th element. That is a of i plus 1 equal to a of i. For this example, a of 4 will be shifted to a of 5. Next we decrement the value of i by 1. That is i equal to i minus 1. For this example, after decrement the value of i, i will be 3. Then again we check this condition. k less equal to i. Yes, it is true. Then we execute this two statement again. a of 3 will be shifted to a of 4. And then i will be decremented by 1. And then again check this condition. Now i equal to 2 and k equal to 3. So this condition is false. Next we insert the element to the kth position. That is a of k equal to x. For this example here we put the 7. After inserting an element the length of the array will be incremented by 1. So we can write n equal to n plus 1. And then exit. That's it. Next we see how we can implement it using C programming. Here our first task is to declare an array that hold the input numbers. So I am going to declare here int array and the size of the array is 100. Then we declare other variables also that we use in our program. So I am going to declare here element num i and position. Next, I am going to ask user how many elements they want to enter. Printf enter number of elements. We read the input number using scanf function. So, I am going to write here scanf percent d and here we refer ampersand num. Next, I am going to ask user to enter the elements. Printf enter elements to read the elements we use here a for loop for i equal to 0 i less than num and then i plus plus and inside the curly braces I am going to write scanf percent d and here we refer ampersand array i. Next we print the input array to the screen. So I am going to copy it and paste here 
I'm going to write here input array is here I'm going to write printf give here a space and delete the ampersand sign next I'm going to ask user what element they want to insert printf enter the element to be insert and then scanf percent d and here we refer ampersand element next I'm going to ask user where they want to insert the element printf enter the position we read the position using scanf function scanf percent d and here we refer ampersand position next we initialize the loop counter to upper bound that is i equal to num minus 1 since array element number from 0 so the last element will be 1 less than the number of element that's why we initialize here i equal to num minus 1 next we shift all the elements from position to upper bound to its one higher position until the value of i is less than the position so i'm going to write here while position less equal to i and inside the loop i'm going to write here array of i plus one equal to array of i and then decrement the value of i by 1 that is i minus minus next we insert the element that is array of position equal to element after inserting an element total number of elements will be incremented by 1 for that I am going to write here num plus plus next we print the array so I am going to copy it and paste here I am going to write here after insertion array is let's check the output compile and run as you can see here it asks for number of element I am going to enter 5 enter elements I am going to enter 5 2 3 8 and 9 input array is 5 2 3 8 9 then it asks for element to be insert I am going to enter 6 enter the position I am going to enter 2 so 6 will be inserted at second position here we consider array element started from 0th position this is the 0th position this is the first position and this is the second position so 6 will be inserted this position means 6 will be inserted after 2 let's check as you can see here 6 is inserted after 2 that's it hope you understand if you have any doubt please comment on the video and if you have any suggestion please tell us next tutorial we discuss array deletion thanks for watching to watch more videos please subscribe this channel slide hunt you can like my Facebook page at www.facebook.com slash slide hunt and you can follow me on Google Plus at www.google.com slash plus slide hunt.